Testing, testing, testing. Ah. This nice bougie setup. Welcome to another video. I have not done a sit down video in a while. And today I wanted to share with you guys some of my favorites for this transition from spring into summer. For those of you who don't know, I live in South Florida. So the transition from spring into summer is pretty drastic. So it goes from being kind of cool-ish to extremely hot and pretty much unbearable and suffocating. So here are some of my favorites that help me transition kind of into summer and get me ready for the summertime here. In no particular order, let's start with skin. I actually could not pick just one skincare product, I picked two. So I went with two prequel products. I've been loving this brand recently. They are super, super friendly to very sensitive skin like mine. I typically react to almost everything. So finding something that really works for my skin is huge. The first product that I'm gonna talk about is probably my favorite one, the Barrier Therapy and Skin Protection Cream. This stuff has saved my soul. I typically get heat rashes really bad in the summertime here. Usually like on the insides of my thighs, I get them pretty bad and on my legs. So I put a little bit of this cream on after I shower and it pretty much takes away all that itching and eczema-like skin. So I love this stuff a lot. The prequel mineral sunscreen, this stuff works wonderfully on my sensitive skin on my face. It is very light, so it doesn't feel like super tacky and thick on. I usually put this on in the morning before work or really just daily for the summertime. This is another very good skin product going into summertime. I will be using a lot of and could not recommend more. I have been loving lip oils lately. This is the Glow Oil by Dior. And this stuff is, I mean, pricey but uh, well worth the price, I would say, in my opinion. I have it on right now, it's very shiny, gives you a very dewy, glowy look for the summertime. And this, I think I got for Christmas last year and I just started using it now. Don't ask me why, I have a lot of lip glosses. It's in the color Rosewood, 012, so. I would run. So for clothes, I picked a couple different things that I've been wearing a lot lately and that I find are very good transition to summer pieces. So I'll start with shoes. These sandals, I got these last summer. These are so cute. They're like knotted sandals. And I have these in a few different colors. These were I think like 20 bucks on ASOS. And they go with everything. You can wear them to the beach, you can wear them up, you can dress them down absolutely a staple for the summer. Because I work, I can't always wear sandals, so I thought I'd throw a pair of sneakers in here to show you guys. This is a pair of, I believe they're called vintage Havanas, but I'm not exactly sure. A very expensive shoe that I found for very cheap at, uh, I think it was an outlet. And I think these originally retail for like over a hundred bucks and I got these for like, I think 50, around 50 or 60 bucks and they do not disappoint. I wear these all the time. I've been wearing these to work a lot recently and they're kind of, they kind of look like the Golden Goose ones, but a lot less expensive, but just another pair of sneakers that go with everything that I've been wearing a lot lately. So for clothes clothes, I've been really into little pajama sets, just like the little delicate looking ones that have the lace and the bows that are really cute. These, this set is from Brandy Melville and I just love it. It's got like these little posies on it and that's the top. And then also they come with like these little boxer shorts. This is a perfect type of attire for sleeping during the summertime. Go grab a pair of those for the summer. And then the last piece of clothing I wanted to show you guys that I've been loving so far this summer that I actually got in the winter time for the summer were uh, these Uniqlo tank tops. They are very cool because they actually come with, I'm gonna try to show this, but they actually come with a bra in the inside. You just pop it on and you just go about your day. You don't have to worry about anything else. And it's a tank top, so it keeps you cool in the summertime. What more could you ask for? I don't know. 
it's pretty much a gift within a gift with that one. My favorite hair product that I'm loving, I have two as well. I could not choose for the life of me, but the first thing I'm gonna show you is this AG Care Mousse Gel. This stuff has been locking in my curls beautifully. It squirts out as a mousse and then it holds as a gel. So when your hair is wet and you're trying to form the curls, you put a little of this, you scrunch it up, and then once it's firm, you can use a diffuser or you can let it air dry and it keeps those curls looking nice. I mean, spirals for days. And then another uh, tool I've been loving is the Denman brush. If you have not heard of this brush or have not used it and you're on the fence, buy this brush if you have curly hair. It actually completely ribbons your hair out when you style it definitely gives you those nice to find curls. So definitely two must haves for the summertime. One thing that's a must here in Florida is a good pair of sunnies. These are chef's kiss. These are a dupe for the Prada sunglasses. I got these ones on Amazon. They were only like $13. And honestly, they're still giving, I mean, I'm one who really likes designer look, but doesn't ever want to spend that much on a pair of sunglasses. So if you are me and I am you, go grab these. These are amazing. The book that I am currently reading is Britney Spears, The Woman in Me. It's very, very good. I like to go between like fiction and nonfiction and biography. This one's really, really good. And if you haven't read this, go read it. That's all I can say. Some of the snacks I've been loving, again, I picked two because if you haven't already been able to tell by now I'm not great at making decisions. Really, I've been into anything peanut butter. So these are from Costco. These are the chocolatey and peanut butter fudge dipped cookie bites. These are so good. They're like little, almost like Oreos, but like peanut butter Oreos dipped and chocolate. And then they have little caramel on them. These are so good. Mm. Almost remind me of like the Girl Scout cookies that are the sandwich cookies, not the peanut butter, not the tagalongs, but like the ones that are sandwich cookies. My Girl Scouts, you need to jump on this. Also, peanut butter M&Ms, because I've been peanut butter crazy lately. If you're allergic to peanuts or peanut butter, crunchy cookie M&Ms, also delicious. Yeah. You already know I've been talking about this a lot on my channel. If you're new here and have not noticed, I have converted to a full-time Awala person. I can't say more positive things about this water bottle, honestly. It's just the only thing I will say that doesn't hit the mark is that it's very thick, so it doesn't fit in most cup holders, but it's not even really a deal breaker for me. I just love like the mechanics of it. Let's go ahead and try that again. I swear, this has never happened. Not good marketing for a walla right now. Thank God they don't sponsor me. There we go. <laughs> Coolest thing about it is that it has a sip straw and it has a uh, chug straw. If you wanna carry it around, it's got a handle. And then if you're like me and you're extra, you can create little like jewelry for it. I have a newfound obsession recently of jelly cats. And I don't know what it is about them, but they've got me in a chokehold. They are so precious. If you know me, you know I'm a plushie lover and I can't get enough of these little guys with the little smiles. Oh, he is just so cute. And now I already wanna order like 30 more RIP my bank account because these guys are not cheap, but their quality is amazing and they are well worth their price even though it's a little bit out there. These guys are my favorite ever and I am loving them. I'm here for it. I'm here for the jelly cat madness. That is going to be it for my spring into summer favorites. Thank you so much for watching. It's been a pleasure. 